Hey lads, welcome back to the channel, and today there's another Brawl Stars video. Of course, the new update still hasn't dropped, but the Brawl Talk did, and it's a minute, so let's see what all the fuss is about. They also said it's not Club Wars, it's Club League, so let's get into it. <laughs> Very nice. Very nice suits. Yeah, they did pretty much delay Brawl Talk for a long time. Oh yes, very cool glasses. I should get myself some of those. <laughs> is that is Ryan just as Danny, right? That's very cool. Oh, that's all. So let's get into it, Frank. What, where, how is Club League? Well, Paula. Club League is a new competition for, well, clubs, of course. Oh, yes, this is very cool. Commitment and activity from I wonder what they're going to do for it. First, each Club League season lasts one week. Club League Club weekly League competitive matches. That's pretty cool. There are no opt-ins, no opt-outs. It all happens oh, and the that's very cool. Based on your club rank. Ooh, you, it's also like, like Power League. That that's going to be very unbalanced if everybody Club starts at, as it called, Bronze 1. But the matchmaking will calibrate itself based on the club performance as seasons continue. It's really important to mention that if you change clubs after the season started, you won't That's be very able cool. to participate in the current season. Oh, so it's only gonna be. So stay loyal to your it's gonna be a weekly thing. Then That's very cool. Sorry, guys, you guys can't join my clan three since it's already. Wednesday, oh, three days to team up with your club mates. Oh, that's pretty cool. I thought it was gonna be like, hourly, like, like one whole season. Well, that pretty much fixes the thing of like people playing in other states and countries. Oh. Dang. Power league matches ish type thing. Yeah, that's very cool. Oh, they're bringing back tickets. That's very radical. Hope that stays unlike the last time they had them. <laughs> Takes one ticket to play a regular, but two to play the power league version. I think that makes sense, I guess. If you win, maybe you get a higher reward. And it looks like you do win. You get. It looks like you don't even lose trophies if you lose. That's pretty cool. However, it is possible to contribute to your club by playing along with randoms. And it was important for us to give those of you who don't want to be that social a way to still contribute to the success of a club and get rewarded. Last but not least, that's relatable. Also purchase and use up to four golden tickets per week. Oh, this sounds like it's gonna be pay to win, but I'm pretty much filming this the day it's gonna be posted, so I already know it's not gonna be since I've seen quite a, some videos of people like Kyro's Time and Ray Brawlstar saying that's not gonna be on um, pay to win fully. So yeah, that kind of ruins this reaction, but I already know what's gonna happen. It's pretty cool that we're playing against other clubs in an eight club thingy, majiggy. But it's pretty. I thought they were gonna do something like club on club, like I don't know, five of a club fight another five people in a different club for points or something like that, which would have been pretty cool. Seasons, uh, yeah, pretty cool. You get promoted or demoted. That's pretty awesome. Or demoted, as well as yes, the amount of rewards. Rewards come in the form of a new currency, club coins. Yes, oh yeah, power seven. coins. Your individual level of rewards is based on end of the season reward. Coin, the weekly rank. That's well pretty cool. A new type of currency, club and I've already heard about the new other currency. Like potato squeak. Potato potato squeak. But my favorite has to be chicken rico. I'm guaranteed gonna buy that. In practice, that means that after a few seasons have passed, you have the potential to increase your individual progression by more than 50% compared to before. More than 50%? That's insane! Dang! That's awesome. In the shop, you will find wildcard powerpoints, coins... No, those coins don't look worth it whatsoever. Oh, wow, the new currency. Wonder what that can be. I'm kidding, I already know what it can be. And it looks like that's gonna be Gears. Well, how did I know? Because I watched the video beforehand. Yes. It's not that much of a reaction, but more of a my talk about it. I think these may break the game. 
if I'm not mistaken. We've changed things around a little bit. You are still unlocking gadgets at level 7 and star powers at level 9. But getting a star power That's very cool that they're giving, like, they're putting another level just like in Clash Royale. Instead of being level 13, it's now level 14 Clash Royale, but now it's level 11 instead of level 10, which is pretty cool. And there's two gear slots, which is also pretty nice. Not gonna lie, I think this is gonna do a big impact on the game, but let's see. Even though it's almost guaranteed, this is gonna do a heck of an impact on the game on certain brawlers, like, I can already see. Like, Mortis having like the regen and the shield thing, just being freaking OP. And what's cool is that you can get these these gear scraps out of boxes, which is pretty cool. That's what I'm gonna do an unboxing when this update update drops, which you, I guess you guys can look up for that. Back and see all almost like deadly combos. Once a gear is crafted, it is bound to a specific broken. You know, I could see this taking a very, very long time to do or to get every single gear. And of course, it can be leveled up to 2 and 3, which is also quite a big difference in this game, not gonna lie. I can just see freaking. How's it called? I don't know, Poco having more damage or more health, Frank being even more tanky than what he already is, 40 different builds is very awesome, and very complex, it's gonna change everything in the game, but it's gonna mean I'm gonna have to gem, not gem them, get a lot of boxing and get a lot of power point pieces, I was maxed out for a bit. Like, all I could get was star points of Colonel Ruffs. I was maxed out with almost all my brothers, except Colonel Ruffs. Oh yeah, I forgot about the... How's it called? Yeah, this. Which is very cool, now we can get three cool pins. And Burglar Jesse, which is pretty nice. Of course, I may have to stream that when that pops out, so then I can get this Cat Burglar Jesse skin. But who knows if I will do this. So guys, I think that's pretty much the whole update. But one last thing before I leave. I may be stop playing Brawl Stars. It's getting kind of boring, not gonna lie, but not gonna lie that this is making me get interested again. So yeah guys, that's all. Hey, so I hope you enjoyed. If you want to see more of me, my newest videos on the left and some random videos on the right. So, hope you have a nice day and I'll see you later. Goodbye.